Hey everybody, it's Harry from Super Daddy Barbecue, the YouTube channel that teaches you how to master barbecue so you can spread barbecue love. I have a super easy dish that I'm going to make for you today. It's uh, inspired by the folks in the Philippines. It's called a Filipino style pork adobo. I have uh, some uh, pork here. We're going to be cooking it up with a marinade of uh, using some soy sauce, a little bit of dark soy sauce, a little bit of uh, a Filipino style vinegar. You don't need Filipino style vinegar, regular vinegar works fine, but uh, if you want to be authentic, this is the version that I have. A little bit of ground black pepper, just a touch of some crushed red pepper, bay leaf, onion, and garlic, and we're ready to get started. <laughs> All right, we dump everything into the bag. Super simple to marinate. We add about a uh, quarter cup of soy sauce. So, some of the uh, dark soy sauce. If you don't have it, just add some extra sugar. Don't worry about this. Add about uh, three tablespoons of this. Some uh, Filipino style vinegar about a half cup black pepper, probably about one teaspoon, and uh, some red chili flakes. Uh, if you want it spicy, if you don't like it spicy, don't uh, put some chili flakes in it. Just skip this part. You can also add cayenne if you like to have a, just a little bit of a bite to it. Just gonna put a pinch of uh, chili flakes in here. So mix up the bag and let it marinate for at least an hour or preferably overnight. It's all good. After marinating your pork, uh, let's go ahead and drop it in the pit. I'm going to drop it into the uh, cast iron pan for a little bit of a smoke and we'll cook it until it's tender. We're smoking it at uh, 275. We let it get some smoke on a cast iron pan on a smoke fire EX6. After about uh, an hour, you can go ahead and do a flip. Some smoke on the other side also. All right, let's give it another turn. And you wanna to try to do this every half hour or so and cook it until the uh, pork is tender. You can feel it from the uh, pressing the tongue against it. Looking beautiful. It's got that color now. After you feel that it's tender, you want to go ahead and uh, move it over to the stove to kind of burn off the extra water. So, and uh, we want to reduce it so that it's nice and syrupy. Well, now for the uh, moment of truth, let's give it a taste here. Get some rice. Some of that wonderful sauce on the bottom here. The uh, meat is super tender. And you can cook it to any level of tenderness you like. Sometimes uh, it tastes better when it's not so tender. Try it with the rice and the sauce first. Wonderful flavor. You get a soy the hint of the uh, tanginess from the vinegar. I taste a little bit of smoke also in the sauce. Let me try a piece of the uh, meat here. Hmm, pork is really good. It's got a marinade from uh, the garlic that we used earlier. A little bit of the dark soy sauce, light soy sauce. Really fantastic flavor. Also, uh, just a tiny hint of heat from the chili flakes that we used. What I did was at the end, uh, you always have to check final seasonings. I like my adobo a little bit tangy. 
So I added a little bit more of a splash of the Filipino style vinegar at the end. I also add just a slightly amount of soy sauce at the end because I like it a little saltier. But this is a fantastic combination of something that's salty, soy sauce-like, and the uh, beans is jumping on me already. So let me uh, have one more bite. Ooh, this piece looks really good for beans. Is you ready for a piece of uh, wonderful tasting pork adobo? Mmm, pork adobo. Yum. Okay, so uh, this is uh, pork adobo, Mr. Beans approved, cooked on the pit, smoked a little bit, and then uh, we just kind of dried out the sauce in a, uh, a burner. So ready to go with some steamed rice, and I think Mr. Beans likes it, right? So thanks guys for stopping by, watching this episode, short episode, with a little bit of pork I had left over cooking barbecue ribs. So until the next video, we will see us. Say bye, Beans. Say bye. Okay, Bean Senses love to all of you guys out there. Thank you.